are you guys? Welcome to the video. Uh, this video will be heading down to a place called Tail and Bend, which is just under 100 k's out of Adelaide in South Australia. Um, we've been to Tail and Bend or been through a Tail and Bend uh, a bunch of times, but we've never actually stayed there. We'll be heading down there for a few days this time, and we're actually going to be doing something pretty exciting that I've been looking forward to for a long time now. We'll be heading to the Bend Motorsport Park. The Ben Motorsport Park is an absolutely epic place. Highly recommend that you stop in there if you're ever traveling past. It's actually known to be one of the world's longest permanent racetracks. I think it's the second longest permanent racetrack in the world. And the quality of this track is absolutely amazing. We've stopped in there once or twice before, just into the showroom there. And there's some absolutely amazing cars in there to see. We'll be staying at the Big Four Caravan Park, which is right next to the racetrack. And uh, we'll be heading to the racetrack on Sunday. And we'll be doing some hot laps in a Porsche GT3 911 Cup car, which is going to be absolutely amazing. I'm so pumped. Hopefully the weather holds off. The weather's not looking the best at the moment, but that's all right. We'll do what we can with what we're given. Hopefully the weather is nice for Sunday's hot laps and we can go a little bit faster. I'm keen as to take the camera in there and show you guys what that's all about. I've been looking forward to this for a long time. So pretty keen to jump in that car and, and uh, go as fast as we possibly can. Big four down there actually looks really, really nice. Um, pretty keen to show you around there as well. I've never been there. I've had some other people that have been there and they said it was all right. So uh, we'll head down there. We're gonna get the van all packed. The car's pretty much packed. We've got a few more things to put in the caravan and then we're pretty much ready to head off. So. We'll take you guys with us. I hope you enjoy the video. Make sure you like and subscribe, guys. And we've got a ton of videos for all you people that have just taken delivery of your Y62 patrols. We love our patrol. We've had it since brand new. I know the audience for the patrol has grown significantly recently. So congratulations on all you guys that have got your hands on the patrol because it's a bloody awesome car. It tows really well and we're really happy with ours after all we've done with it. Like I said, stay tuned. We'll take you with us. We'll show you around the big four at the bend and also we'll take you around the racetrack as well. We're Probably, hopefully if the weather stays good for us, I'm gonna take little Ollie and myself and Bianca on the go-karts as well, which will be really, really fun. They've got an amazing go-kart track there, which is really cool. Tail and Bend's got a few things to see and do around there. So we're gonna be exploring around. The river does run through Tail and Bend as well, the Murray River. Uh, on its way down to the mouth at Galway. So it should be a really beautiful place. There's beautiful cliffs along there. So we're really keen to show you guys around. Stick around and I hope you enjoy the video. guys so we finally made it here uh, yesterday it was a pretty easy drive nothing too hard um, up the freeway some beautiful scenery and everything as well um, the car and the van obviously got here nice and easily as well there's no dramas whatsoever uh, we're not like I said before we're not too far out of Adelaide so it's not a massive trip um, it took us about an hour and a half roughly um, and then we've arrived here yesterday but we just did uh, a bit of relax we just chilled out a bit once we got here and uh, unpacked everything and um, just had a few drinks and a nice night. It was beautiful. It is a bit windy here, which is uh, a little bit annoying, but it is what it is. I don't know if you can hear that in the background, but we've got the racetrack probably uh, maybe 500 meters away from the big four where we're staying. And um, you can hear all the screeching in the race cars as well, which is really cool. So Ollie and I had a little ride over there this morning. Um, and they've got a skid pan open today where they've got some people learning to drift and, and the tracks all wet down. I'll show you some footage of that was really, really cool to see. Uh, a bunch of different people in their cars just learning how to control the cars, which was good. A basic rundown of the park here. It's set out a little bit different to what I'm used to or what, what we normally see around the place. Basically, there's these grass strips the whole way across the park um, and then a little bit of dirt as well where you back your van up on there uh, onto the grass just a little bit. The lady did say half, half, uh, on the dirt and the grass, but 
everyone else here is parked up on the grass so we've sort of backed the van back on the grass so we've got a nice grassy patch under the awning all the stuff here it's actually really really quiet at the moment um there's not a whole lot of people i'm not sure if you can see if that'll focus in the background but uh yeah there's not a whole lot of people i'm just hiding out behind the van at the moment because it's a little bit windy there's a pool here games room they're actually really really nice and the place is really well set out the only downfall is at night uh, i believe there might be some goods trains or something like that that go past you know they could be miles away really but the wind sort of carries that noise so it was a little bit noisy last night in that sense but other than that it's been really nice we're just getting ready now to head over to the racetrack i'm going to be doing uh some hot laps in a porsche cup car which i'm absolutely thrilled about it's going to be so good um we're going to head over there and have a look around the ben motorsport park uh, we're probably about an hour and a half early so we're going to head over now so we've got some time to look around because I know that they've got some amazing cars there as well so I'll take you guys with us of course I'm not sure whether I'm going to be able to film inside the car with my camera but I think they do supply footage as part of the whole experience um, plus I'll give the phone and the camera to Bianca and she can do some outside filming from the balcony as we cruise past which would be really cool all right guys no more talking I'm going to get over there get ready and uh, we'll see you at the Ben Motorsport Park
back from that crazy experience the Porsche race car experience was absolutely amazing I had an absolute ball in there definitely buggered the g-forces that that car pulls around the corners and when it's on the brakes I'm pretty sure I'll have to check the footage I was focused on where we were going but I'm pretty sure we hit almost 230 k's 240 k's an hour down the straight I have to look at the footage and see exactly how fast we did go but um, I know that some of those corners were unreal the amount of g-forces that you pull on braking and cornering was just um mind-boggling it was quite an experience we've also got some drifting that's happening at the moment we've stopped by there for a little while and uh you know had a couple of drinks and watched that while that was on that was really cool to see um we've just made our way back to the caravan now and uh we're probably gonna settle in for the afternoon we're gonna play some basketball have a bit more of a look around the park as well um, and one thing to note with this caravan park as well you can have fires here so you can have a little uh, fire pit that's off the ground um, and you can have it on the stones obviously not on the grass just on the stones the lady said um, so we've got our little fire pit that we have I'll put a link down below to where you can grab that fire pit if you want there's a ton of fire pits on the market nowadays that um, they're quite small and handy to take with you so they're easy to chuck in the front of the caravan and, um, and take around with you it's not just not very often that you find a caravan park that you can uh, have the fire pit set up which is really cool so uh, we're gonna have a drink pour a drink and uh, get this fire pit set up and, uh, and enjoy the night, I think. The wind's died down a little bit, which is good, so we'll see how we go with the fire. We were lucky enough to have a beautiful day today, so we've gone out exploring just around Tail and Bend, and we've come down to where the ferry is. So there's a ferry at Tail and Bend that crosses the river, uh, so you can get to the other side. We've just come down here on the little jetty down here and we've chucked the rod in. We'll do a little bit of fishing and enjoy the sun today. Um, and then we might find our way up to the bakery. There's a bakery one street over from the highway in the main street of Taylor Bend that looks nice. So we might go test that out a little bit later, but uh, for now we'll see if we can catch some fish, enjoy the sun, some beautiful green grass over there as well. There's a bunch of people all fishing down on the, uh, on the edge of the river. Let's see how we go. Dude, bring it up on the on the jetty. Bring it up on the jetty. So we're just pulling up at our last little outing for this short trip. We've um, we've heard that the go-karts here are really, really cool and really fun. So we're gonna jump on the go-karts for a little bit. Um, I'll put the prices down below and, uh, and how to book them, but it didn't seem too badly priced and they do have singles and doubles. So we're gonna take, I'm gonna take Ollie with me on my go-kart and Bianca's gonna take Kiana on hers. Uh, and we'll have a bit of a race. It looks like there's some other people here, so there should be some other people on track. The track here looks pretty crazy. So it looks fast and fun. Um, I think the layout can change a lot as well. So I'll, I'll probably chuck the drone up and maybe show you a bit of a top down uh, shot of the track. Just showing exactly how big it is as well. But um, the carts are known to be pretty fast here. So I'm pretty pumped to get out there. And I think Ollie and Keanu are pretty excited too. Uh, we'll show you some of the footage once we get out there.
break that we did in South Australia, which is really cool. Um, those go-karts were absolutely amazing. They were really fast and Ollie and Keanu had an absolute ball in them as well. We are just packing up the van now to head off. We're gonna head back home. Kiana's got some dance classes tonight. She's got a big uh, concert coming up. So we thought it'd be uh, pretty important for her to get back for that. We've just uh, packed up the caravan. Caravan's all good to go, hooked up to the car. And uh, we've only gotten about an hour and a half drive to get home. So um, we've been really happy with this day. The big four has been really good. Very, very quiet, which is a bit strange, but um, I guess my tips, if I was to suggest anything for uh, the, staying at this big four um, in Tail and Bend, it would be to probably check the race schedule um, of the racetrack nearby. And there's also a drag strip that's just being built. Um, if you're into that stuff, it's really great. If you're not so much into that stuff, maybe check the schedule um, and just check if anything's on because uh, the noise from the track does carry this way to the caravan park quite a, quite a fair bit. So keep that in mind. Apart from that, it's a beautiful caravan park, very open, um, stuff for the kids to do. There's a pool, there's a jumpy pillow, um, there's all sorts of stuff to do. So river's probably about five or so minutes away, so it's a short drive away. As you saw, we caught some fish down there and went for a bit of a walk as well. Um, but yeah, overall, really positive experience. We had a great time and uh, highly recommend it to anyone else as well. Easy, guys. Uh, please like and subscribe if you like the video, if you want to stay up to date with uh, what we're doing, what we're doing with the patrol. We've got a really big trip coming up, which we're really, really excited about. Um, I won't say anything just yet, but uh, there's a lot of planning going into it and uh, something we've never done before, and it's pretty epic. So uh, we're really pumped to talk to you about that when the time comes. But uh, other than that, guys, thank you for watching. If you've made it this far, I really appreciate you guys sticking around and watching the video and uh, hopefully we'll speak to you soon.